afternoon to you. My name is Baba Tando, and I bring you the latest in the world of sports. Let's get talking right here, right now. Ghana Football Association President Christine Yante, she has admitted to the simmering tension between himself and his vice, George Efriye. The duo have been reported to be at loggerheads for a while now, and I've had Sports Minister Isaac Isiama intervening in the matter. FA President, who doubles as Vice President of the Confederation of African Football, admits the Ghana Football Association is a human institution, and definitely there will be divergent opinions. I, I don't know, but <laughs> uh, I think that every human institution, every human institution will one time or the other uh, encounter difficulties. But the strength in the institution is your ability to overcome these challenges and move forward. And I think there are no issues for us to contain ourselves with. All right, so member of the executive committee of the GFA, Frank Nelson in Wokolo, admits the feud between Kutin Yantichi and George Free has affected the administration in a negative way. Well, definitely we're in a house. This is the headquarters of Ghana Football Association. When the president is not there, who is there? Is the vice president. Now, the issue is that you need to be truthful to yourself. Exactly. How comfortable it is for the vice to operate when there are issues like this and how comfortable it is for the president to be able to take a decision knowing that there's an issue between him and the vice. So definitely administratively there will be little bit minuses and uh, people might take advantage of this situation. That's why I say we need to travel as fast as we can to be able to make sure that we fill the portals and then have a smooth road traveling. And otherwise, you might find people who can capitalize on a situation like this. Before you know, it will explode to a big situation. So according to the board member of Accra Hats to Folk, Frank Nelson in Wokolo, the executive committee will do everything possible to ensure reconciliation since the feud has, uh, will have adverse effects on running football if it is not curbed. Yeah, yes, we've heard about text messages, we've heard about issues. So some of us will condemn and will condemn till death. I don't think it's a big issue. People like us are around and I believe that my judge is my brother. Anytime I speak to him, whatever his position is, he will definitely recoil. It will not go well because the two of them are ahead of us. If uh, President Yantet is not there, the next person is judge. So we cannot do without them. So in as much as they are there, we must make sure to reconcile this situation. We must put our best and make sure that we resolve. They are brothers. It will not be good for me to say that tomorrow, Kwesi, uh, President Kwesi and uh, George are not in talking terms for one reason or the other. They have been here together. I mean, they've been friends. They've been brothers. They've sat together, sleepless nights, thinking about this nation in terms of football, travel together, mm -hmm. stays in hotel rooms, share things, food together. So why is it at this time that we'll close our eyes and say these people should go apart? It's not possible. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, we are around them. We are not being friends. There's more sports on the sports page on myjoyonline.com. We're tweeting live. The handle is at joysportsgh. On Facebook, the address is joysports. Tweet at me personally. My handle is at barbatando. And it's same for Instagram. That's your sport. Good afternoon.